please give me the correct answers. What do I need to know about these group of women? What do I need to know about these group of women in the now energy? It doesn't matter what energy. Please give me the correct answers. I need to know about a group of women as of right now. Please give me the correct answers that I need. Please give me the correct answers. Try to get a person killed. So these group of women of these group of women tried to get a person killed. Okay. Why though? I want to know. Why were they trying to get someone killed for? I want to know actually. I want to know why is these group of women okay upright. Why are these women in a group tried to get someone killed for? I need to know this. Why? Very toxic women. Drama. Chaotic. Path of destruction. So these group of women almost got someone killed because of lying. A tune to the divine. Okay. So, these women try to get someone killed in a group over because of toxicity. It's pretty much toxic behavior, lies, rumors, and you were attuned to the divine that you were going to find this out about a group of females. Okay. How toxic they were. Always talking about stuff. Regardless of how you felt. Can I know why they were being so toxic? What were they being so toxic about? Drama related. Why? What is behind it? Separation's killing me. It's over because somebody separated from them and purposely ignoring you. Oh, so you're going to act petty and try to get a person killed because their separation and somebody's purposely ignoring you and you want to have a group of women and a group trying to kill somebody over your petty ass shit? Are you kidding me? And whoever you did try to do this to, they're very in tuned. They know this of what you try to do. Okay? They already know how toxic you are. Can I know else why they were trying to get a person killed for over their toxicity, drama, lies? It was over love. There was a love situation that was going on, actually, about a woman. And she got mad. The temple path. She got mad. Because somebody. Had to separate. I'm thinking. There's a lot of women in this group. Is wanting to get. Certain men hurt. Or one specific man. It's over because of love. And somebody. Was not respecting themselves. That when they separated themselves. Purposely ignoring these hoes. They started to respect the temple path. Of respecting their body. To where they weren't getting used. Because they didn't have no money. Love, money, sex. 
something in that sense, some type of drama. And then we got rumors, gossip, deceitful behavior, cheating, as like I said, brought hostility because they are pissed off because whoever whoever did this drop the hose the sex all this toxicity chose to be with a happy family it brought the sun it brought the sun meaning happy joyful that the person finally got their shit together pretty much that the shit show Jerry Springer Maury has shut it the fuck down. You're in tune to the divine. That's why there's a group of women trying to kill a person. Tried to get a person killed. Was because of drama. Toxicity. Possibly drugs. Money. Sex. Rumors. Hostility. Over love. How pathetic can you be, ladies? Trust me, it's not worth it. That's very petty. Or I could be picking up on men doing this too. But I said a group of females. That's acting the fuck up over because of love. Because somebody quit talking to them. Because they're not getting their coins anymore. Because somebody finally respected their body to not be broke anymore. Got tired of being deceitful. That's funny how it went. It's kind of funny how it fell. This person pretty much fell flat on their face. When the day it came from that to hostility... They fell flat on their faces when a person decided to get away from that, the toxicity, and started to have a happy family where it brought the sun. That's crazy. How women would be so pissed off. And I would say if there's females out here in a group trying to kill you, because of over love, sex, money, there's a problem. And they're losing their fucking minds. Now, what about this happy family in the sun? What is this about? Fourth chakra. Yep. Seventh chakra. Is going to somewhat have to be healed. These are going to have to, in order to have a happy family, to bring the sun, it's going to have to be worked on their chakras, actually. It's going to take a lot of work. There's some chakras messed with because of these toxic females who were pissed, who tried to get in between a happy family life, and now... The person is stuck with, with the 4th chakra and the 7th chakra. What else do I need to know? Huh? <laughs> That's so weird. Yep. Door to personal healing and happiness. Pretty much in order to have a happy family, you have to heal and work on happiness and let things go. And there's fourth chakra, seventh chakra, first chakra in order to bring the sun back around. Because these females had a strategy. They had this planned out that they were going to try to destroy you with drama. Drama, chaos, over because of somebody quit talking to them and quit giving them dick. Sex, money, love. Yeah. And is pissed off because these women 
are in separation. Separation's killing them. Because they are being ignored. In order for a happy family to have son back in their life. Whoa, that's weird. I don't know why that came out. But okay, maybe there's a reason for it. Huh. That was a little weird. The son to bring happiness back into a relationship that was being fucked with. Hardcore. That's why the hostility, the rumors, gossip, lying, rumors, hostility. So these women thought they were cute of bringing you hostility. These women thought it was cute to bring you violence. Mm -mm. Pretty much they strategize this. So you know what the universe is strategizing? That you want to mess with love. Okay. We'll make you lose your minds, females. Because you strategize this. So we're going to strategize that you get hostility back. Send back to sender all the drama. All the chaos. All the deceit. Send back the sender on these group of women's parts. Pretty much. You wanted drama. If you don't want smoke, don't be messing with the chosen one. Don't be messing with somebody hardcore. Because then you too shall figure out who God really is. And you thought by doing this, you thought you were God. God's going to put you in your place. I promise you that. And that's why you're flipping out, stressing out. Now you feel hostility, but you strategized it, but it's going to come back your way. Everything you have done. Try to get a person killed may happen to you. I'm just going to be blunt. You know what I mean? Can't be out here trying to destroy other people's lives and thinking you're cute because you ain't cute when you do that shit you're not it just shows how desperate you are and you don't know how to love yourself because if you can't really love yourself you're not going to be able to love others properly actually that's how it works so pretty much a strategy they had this all planned out that they were trying to destroy a happy family. And something came in. And woke somebody up. First chakra. Fourth chakra. Seventh chakra. There's going to be need a lot of healing. In order to have a happy family or relationship back to the way it was. Because of these. Narc. Narcissistic people. Energy, vampire, reverse psychology. Very nasty Jezebels. Yeah. Let me see. What else is going on? I need to know. What's going on actually over here with the toxic people. What's going on with the toxic people? Yeah, acceptance. They don't really want to accept... They don't want to accept of what they've done to you is going to come back on them X time harder. And they are in fear that all their plans is going to come right back onto them. Send back to sender. No, you're in fear mode because you didn't think you're going to get caught. You're in fear mode because you're going to be feeling the wrath of people's ancestors. And that's what you get. You reap what you sow. You know what I mean? What goes around comes around. You're going to have to accept this and you better take it up like a boss bitch. Take your karma. Because of the time you thought you were the shit. No, I just stated God's going to show somebody that they're going to be put back in their fucking place. They're fearful of it. They envy 
in their pride. Yeah. They have to accept that they're in fear mode. Their pride and envy. They envy you. And their pride is broken. Because they try to make it out to where you had low self-esteem. But truthfully honest here. You crazy fucking bitches were the one. The hoes out here. That were planning. Try to get someone killed. That your strategies are going to be changed. That you have no peace of mind. Possibly no peace. Probably, you're probably jealous of your friends too. You're fearful of your friends. You're nervous about your health being all fucked up. You need balance. Because you're in the decision of thinking that you needed to know all the answers. All the answers to someone's relationship. It gave you the courage to act fucking stupid. Okay? It gave you the courage to go for cuckoo for cuckoo puffs. It gave you the courage to do this. But the outcome is saying that you're, you're worrying... I am learning that worry doesn't change the outcome. Oh, so now you're worried because you know you can't change the outcome of your actions. That just came out right now. I just said God's going to put them in their place. And they're fearful of it. You don't mess with people. The ancestors see this for what it is. Do you bring to toxicity? It's going to come back your way. Your strategy is going to be changed around those group of women. Okay. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's pretty much all that I got for the group of women. And you are in tuned to the divine meaning that you or somebody was needing to know this that you're in tuned you probably already known this scenario was going on but it's going to take a lot of strength a lot of love and a lot of healing from the first chakra fourth chakra seventh chakra to bring the sun into a happy relationship. Into a happy family again. And hopefully somebody learns their lesson. I hope you guys have a good day.